We're going to Dollywood today! Why are your socks on your hands? Can you put them back on your feet? Welcome to Taylor Tadpoles. If this is your first time here, we are a family travel vlog, and today we are going to Dollywood. The land of the wooden... Da, 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 da. Um, I'm going to see Grammy today. We're going to see Grammy today? Yeah! She's going to be at Dollywood with us, huh? I actually spent two days at Dollywood, and I'm gonna just combine both days into one day. We're at Dollywood early this morning. So if you see different colored shirts, that's why. We were there for two days, but both days were amazing, and I'm so excited to share with you Dollywood. Dollywood, baby! <laughs> Competitor number one, yellow and green. Competitor number two, pink and orange. Dollywood, then Austin and I got to go off by ourselves and go ride some of the adult rides while Grammy and Blake watched our kids. The first ride that we rode was called Thunderhead. Thunderhead is a wooden roller coaster and it was super fun. The train goes through the station. Throw Thunderhead! Woo! Thunderhead in the back, not as good as in the front. Runs better, better airtime and smoother. Yeah, it's like butter. First ride of the day. Probably my favorite GCI. I don't know, I think Prowler's better. I think Prowler's better. Yeah, but Prowler just has a special place in my heart. This one was good too, though. Alright, please. Dum 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 Here's my impression of a hibernating bear. Watch closely. Riding on Mystery Mind by ourselves because Grammy and Blake are watching the kids. And this was such a unique roller coaster. Like a lot of roller coasters kind of run together for me. This will not happen with Mystery Mind. You just gotta go on it. It literally felt like I was inside of a mine train that had gone crazy and was going all over the place. So you will definitely not forget this experience. We just got done riding Mystery Mine Train. It was kind of like a wild mouse, but cooler. And I was so scared during some parts that they were just gonna drop me. So it was awesome though. Now My favorite part is the bump bumps. Bump 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 bump. That and the end. Now we're gonna ride Soaring Eagle. Just me and the love of my life. The next ride we rode was Wild Eagle. Soaring Eagle. Flying Wild Eagle. Eagle. Wild Eagle. Wild Eagle. This is a wing coaster, and I typically love wing coasters. Like, I am a sucker for wing coasters because I like to feel like I'm flying. Road Wild Eagle. It was smooth, but there weren't a lot of near misses, so I'm probably putting it at the very bottom of all wing coasters in the country. Because I've ridden them all now, and this one was the worst. But it was fun. Like, you can't go wrong with a good wing coaster. And it's a good wing coaster, it's just not the best. And it's not even the third best. It's the fourth best, which is the worst. The end. My story of Wild Eagle. Tennessee Tornado. Just got done riding Tennessee Tornado. What a whirly ride. I have a little bit of a headache. 
Austin grayed out. I always gray out, but even he grayed out this time. Back row. Yeah, it was fun. Ten conversions. It was fast, so it was over really quick. And I think it's my number two coaster of the park now. It was so great. So twisty turvy. So wonderful. This is a line just for food. The last roller coaster we rode before catching up with our children was Austin's 175th roller coaster. Lightning Rod. Lightning Rod. And this is by far the best roller coaster at the park. It's a Rocky Mountain construction roller coaster, which means they took an old, terrible roller coaster and put steel track on it and made it amazing. And that's exactly what they did with Lightning Rod. got some bread from the grist mill, some cinnamon bread, and we decided that we were going to eat the cinnamon bread while we waited for the Eagle Show to start. So the whole time we're eating our cinnamon bread, we're telling our kids about how we're gonna watch the Eagles and it's gonna be so much fun. Watch the Bald Eagle show. Well, the show starts. <laughs> and we very quickly realized there are not eagles in this show. It's a lot of singing and dancing, which was fine. It was more of an adult show. Like, there wasn't any funny characters, there weren't any animals. But our kids totally loved it. We just sat and watched the singing show that we weren't planning on watching. <laughs> it was kind of hard to leave too because we were in the front row and Kylie kept trying to climb up during the show on the stairs and yeah. After missing the Eagle show, we decided we still wanted to see the Eagles. So we walked up to the Eagle aviary there got a whole bunch of eagles and hawks and um, my husband who knows all sorts of information was teaching our children about them. Do you see it Evelyn? That's a red-tailed hawk. I was not. I don't know stuff about eagles. <laughs> the other thing that we saw while we were there was we saw a chapel. We also got to see Dolly's childhood home. It's just a replica, but it was kind of cool to see how she lived when she was growing up. I mean, she had like 11 brothers and sisters, so that would have been crazy in that little house. One of Grayson's favorite rides was Fire Chaser Express, and this is another Gerslauer. It was so fun because it was like a bigger, it was more like a family ride. Fire Chaser Express. Oh. Uh -huh. oh. Yeah. And he got so excited about it. He loved the theming. He loved feeling like he was a fireman. Fireman? Yeah, Fire Chaser Express. Are you excited? Santa, what do you think? Scary. 
scary. Yeah. Grayson, did you like it? We just went on Fire Chaser Express. What'd you think, bud? Um, you liked it? Yeah. What'd you think, Sienna? Um, scary and I did not like it. You didn't like it? Can we over again? Maybe. Maybe we can do that tomorrow, okay? Um, he wanted to ride that roller coaster over and over and over again. So that just made me super happy that he like loved it. Oh, loved it. my little matching firefighters. Right by the Fire Chaser Express is the Firehouse Fun Yard and it's this little splash pad. And there were a ton of kids and we went there that day and they weren't being very nice to my kids. <laughs> Go play, Evelyn. Are you okay? Oh. Hey, Evelyn, don't do that, please. There's Evelyn. That was my life right here. <laughs> Ride big kid rides with Sienna and Grayson. Woo, guys! I'm scared too. You're scared? Yes. Oh my goodness. Grammy's, the, Grammy's the brave I'll warrior. You. <laughs> they had a huge kitty area there. Our kids loved riding the rides. And one of the rides that was there was a ride called Dragon Flyer, and this is a kitty coaster but it's an invert floorless coaster which means there is nothing underneath your feet. Dragonfly. 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 Flyer. Dragonflyer. Grayson, you excited to ride? Yeah. Who are you? Grabby. Grabby. Oh Grabby. man, I look like a hot mess. Wow. That's rough. It's called the uh, Dragonflyer. We're riding Dragonfly. Grayson and Grammy are riding in the second row. In the third row. Three. Oh, you're so tough, buddy. Grayson went the first day and he did not like it, but he was brave and he did it. What do you think, little man? I you what? I didn't like it. You didn't like it? <laughs> you didn't like it? You sure were brave. That was a fun, speedy little buttery yeah. train. I found myself. I kept just trying to watch him. I know. <laughs> Sienna would not go on it. Then the next day we went to Dollywood, she decided that she was going to be brave and try it. I think Grammy regretted being the one to take her because apparently she screamed and cried the whole time. Uh, we were proud of her and I also felt bad that she was so scared. Scary and I did not like it. Yeah, I'm sorry. Good job trying it though. Mm. That was very brave. She was so brave. That is very brave. Good job. Are you glad Grammy was with you? Yeah, that was nice, huh? How'd you like the green one? No, I cried on it. You cried on it? Yeah, I think I heard you crying on it. Because I was standing and then I heard someone whip by and ah, and I was pretty sure that is my Sienna. Big scream. 
and made me cry in the way. The funny thing is, it's such a smooth roller coaster. Yeah, she did not love it. Blake is such a good babysitter. <laughs> Gets our babies to sleep for us. Lightning and thunder in the area. We're just hanging out under a pavilion. It was really close. It like blew out one of the light bulbs. Hey, Evelyn, be careful. There's a ride that my kids always want to ride at every single amusement park. You excited to ride on this fish ride? Yeah. Good. Grayson? And it's those ones that like are in this bird type thing and it do this and it whips you back and forth. Or not the hummingbird, the mockingbird. Where are you? <laughs> We're riding the mockingbird. No, hummingbird. It's That's called the mockingbird. The mad mockingbird. No, it's not mad. It's mad. No, it's not. Very mad. Let's find Grayson and Daddy. Obviously my kids wanted to go on it. And it look actually went pretty high. See a little fairy. Oh, there's Kylie. Kylie. Evelyn, come on, sweetie. Evelyn. Oh, so cute. Chaser. It was just a super smooth kitty coaster. My kids loved it. Susanna! She goes in first. today is drop line. This is a drop tower. Man, worst spot for them to be in. 
going to drop fast. Watch how fast it goes. Ready? I am scared of heights. I have like grown my uh, courage and bravery and going on roller coasters. <laughs> That was awesome! But drop towers have still got me a little bit. And I decided to grow my bravery by going on drop line. I'm sure it didn't look like I was very brave because I was freaking out and crying and sobbing and I went with Grammy. I'm sure she was a little embarrassed being seen with me. Regardless, I went on it and I screamed like a baby, but I did it. So you can all pat me on the back because I'm sure that I did at the time. lightning rod one last time but the lightning rod got struck by lightning what yeah. crazy messed up the sensors on the launch obviously so we won't be able to ride it tonight again probably oh well time to go let's get out of here it was so much fun at Dollywood. There was so much stuff to try and cram into two days and we honestly didn't get to do everything or see everything or ride everything, but it was awesome. We had such a blast. Oh, she's been a good girl. She's been a good girl. Butterfly. All done. Yay. Butterfly. Oh, she did it. Yeah. 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 Stay tuned next time because next time we're going to Carowinds and it's going to be awesome. If you want to go to Dollywood with your family, be sure to check out our companion channel, Taylor Treventures. That gives you all of the inside scoop to Dollywood. I didn't share all of the facts and the cool information in this video, so you want to go over there to get all of that stuff. That will tell you how to family travel at Dollywood. Thank you so much for watching. Please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe.